please join our YouTube community and subscribe today, as 91% of viewers haven't yet hit that subscribe button. Zhang Wei of the situation weighs his options. Kill them. But you still don't know how to kill the Buddhas. But it's too dangerous to take action, he reflects, his concern evident. Lu Karin echoes his sentiment, highlighting the inadequacy of the vehicles before them. Brother, these people transformed garbage. The price performance ratio is too low. The maximum speed cannot exceed 20 kilometers per hour, she observes. Then, Zhang Yi, ever analytical, scrutinizes their adversaries. Moreover, the modification is too rough, and the fuel consumption is several times. They are really wealthy. Three vehicles were dispatched at once. He remarks, his eyes narrowing with suspicion. Curious about their opponent's technology, Zhang Yi seeks further information. You said this kind of car consumes fuel. Very powerful, right? He inquires. Lu Karin confirms his suspicions. Yeah, these off-road vehicles weigh much more than snowmobiles, she explains. Zhang Wei, mindful of the scarcity of resources, contemplates the implications. Nowadays, it is difficult to obtain gasoline. At the beginning, Exishan Base was reluctant to use snowmobiles. The only way to have such luxury was to use Pan the Yangsheng Base of the oil refinery, is now he muses. Lu Karin makes a startling realization. It's them? Yangsheng Base is almost across the entire Tianhai city, she gasps. Preparing for a potential conflict, Zhang Yi warns Lu Karin. It is flammable and may cause conflict in a while. Be mentally prepared, he advises. Their encounter with the soldiers of Yangsheng base grows tense as Zhang Yi steps out of the car, using his powers to enhance his speed. Don't get me wrong, I mean no harm. I don't have any objection to whether this factory is first come, first served, he assures them. The soldiers, intrigued by Zhang Yi's presence, discuss their next steps. Didn't it mean that the Exishan base has been destroyed one soldier wonders? But, that car of his is nice, another soldier remarks. As tensions escalate, the soldiers decide to bring in their captain for further negotiations. Inform the captain to come over. We can talk to you about this matter after our captain comes, they declare. Their resolve firm. Zhang Yi acquiesces. Well, I can wait, he responds. When the captain finally arrives, Zhang Yi's keen observation skills come into play. Someone used the same method as I did before by hanging a sling from the skylight to enter the interior of the factory. He notes, recognizing the captain's capabilities, 